someone leading the charge on helping veterans with this, and former Navy SEAL and Chief Operating Officer of Operation Restore Warrior Jimmy Watson joins us now. Jimmy, appreciate you being here. Hey, thanks a lot, Carl. It's uh, great to be on your show. Very honored. Yeah, Thank you. Unfortunately, I wish it was better circumstances, but what you're doing is fantastic. I mean, this is a really important organization. And talk to us about what you do, how veterans do it, and, and what, the, what the outcome is. Well, so, so just like you said, you know, I've experienced a lot of tragedy. We, we all have, especially in the SEAL Team Special Operations, veterans alone uh, lost a significant amount of uh, fellow friends from suicide. I was counting the other day from the Marine Corps and the Navy, and it's pretty ridiculous. And so it's an epidemic. It's worse than COVID. Uh, we, we all hear about the 22 veterans a day, right? But in the end, it's, it's really about 40 you know, and it's because it's high risk behavior. They're, they're documenting certain suicides, but they're not accounting for the high risk behavior. And that's what I was doing in my life. I was at the end of my rope, Carl, and ended up finding about finding out about Operation Restore Warrior. I went there. You're, you're looking at a walking, talking testimony to the, what the power of Jesus can do in someone's life and through this organization. There's, there's a lot of organizations out there doing amazing things, but just like in the special operations, uh, we're on a mission. Operation Restore Warrior is on a mission to eradicate veteran and soldier suicide, and we've been quite successful at it, and I just simply um, give the glory to God, you know? Yeah. Well, I mean, it, wherever people can find strength to get through some of these tough things, I mean, we see some gnarly stuff over there, and sometimes we come home and we, we bury it down deep because that's what we've always done. But some of your programs include you know, males, females, veterans, you know, all, of all kinds of veterans, NFL players, coaches, first responders, you have police. I, I, you, how have you found the impact in these things? And, and what, are the, what are some of the actual um, things that people are doing to uh, kind of mitigate the, uh, the stressors? Well, you know, I, I actually went to James Haley Veterans Hospital. I had a traumatic brain injury, but I walked out of there with about 30 diagnoses and about 30 different pills to go along with it in a big old uh, McDonald's looking bag, a brown bag. I walked out of there. I was lost. Like I said, I had tried all the counseling. I had tried all the pills, and it just seemed to exasperate the problem because nobody really knows what the real problem is. Well, Operation Restore Warrior has been around as long as Wounded Warriors, but uh, it's just not on the map like they are. I'll tell you what, man, uh, it's hard to explain what happens there. But when I went there, I received um, my healing. I received my um, what I was searching for all my life and what I did not find in those other programs. Mm -hmm. What about um, like medications now? That's a big, big thing. People are just, hey, here, prescribe this, prescribe that, take this, take nine of these, a hundred of these. You know, uh, are, uh, do you get people off these medications and find true, true strength in oneself? You know, we, we encourage everybody to just stay, you know, stay on what you have and let the, the program do the talking. Whether or not you decide to stay on it uh, when you leave the place is totally up to them. But I'll tell you what, man, uh, what happens there. You know, just like a mission, just like a top secret operation, we, we try to keep it closed lip. Mm -hmm. uh, but it's a, it's a great organization, and it's healing our veterans, you know? No, I, I noticed that you were keeping a lot of this very close to the chest here, and, and now that you say that you, you, that's something you do out of respect, we appreciate that. How, uh, how can people find out more about your program? How can they support it? Yeah, well, we have different companies coming on board, stepping up to the plate at a time like this, like Gladiator Solutions. Um, they've decided to come on board and help us out. So if you're a company out there, you want to help us out, you want to partner with us and make donations or just an individual, you know, $1, just $1 um, goes straight to these guys and, and these gals. And I'll tell you what, I can't imagine a, a better place to put uh, a donation uh, where it's going to the actual veterans. And I, and I just urge everybody uh, to be worthy of the sacrifice that these guys and girls have made. Mm -hmm. And, um, yeah, we just appreciate any donations. Uh, it's OperationRestoredWarrior.org. Yeah, Operation Restored Warrior right down there on the Chiron below us. Yeah. Folks, that's the website right there. Jimmy Watson, stay safe, brother. Appreciate all you're doing. Hey, thank you, brother. Appreciate you. All right, cool.